Yo, what is going on, you slackers? I am your host, Slackers Gaming, bringing you another Rocket League Market Watch Monday. Yeah, it's cool. I love doing these. I say that every week, but I truly mean it. I love doing some market watches. It's, it's a great way to keep up with the ever changing market of items. Duh, market watch, right? So, um, this week, you know, as usual, we always got a theme, and this week's theme is going to be things. Um, what did I write down here? Items that are worth more than you might think. So, um, I'm not saying, you know, you might be sitting on, like, a, a rare topper and it's going to be worth 20 keys. No, I'm not saying that. But I'm going to say they're probably, they could be worth more, you know, a few more keys than you might think. And if you're sitting on it and you're like, dang, I actually got this in my inventory, I would love to go sell this. So, um, I've been keeping track of quite a few things here. I got my little trusty little notepad over here, you know, because I do all my, uh, I take this seriously. I like doing these, so I gotta track my own stuff, right? So, um, yeah, let's get right into it. First thing I'm gonna get to, I got, we got, we all know, Wonderments. A lot of people think they might be overhyped. Some people think they're the next Zombas. I, I kind of think, yes, they are gonna be the next Zombas. Give it a little while more, and then, you know, they'll start eeping up. I mean, over the past week, they jumped up, like, they were insane. Um, but, you know, we're not about the white wonderment. These are a couple of other colors that you want to look out for. Now, um, first one I got here is the forest green ones. And, uh, if we ch check it a little bit, uh, uh, easy for me to say, if we take a look over the past, this is just three days of recording. Um, let's go back. What is the 20th? So go back to the 21st, right? All the way back to the 21st. These things, the forest greens were seven to nine. And if I remember right, I actually have some on my, uh, my good, my, first account i'll call it my first account uh, my slackers gaming account and uh i picked these up for nine um about roughly a little over a week ago or so so i picked them up for nine and um then they started just shooting up like uh uh 22nd uh less than a week ago um uh, eight to ten then they rose to nine to eleven now they're currently sitting and they've been sitting at ten to twelve for the past oh january 25th so three four days here um, so that that's great to see when you pick something up for cheap and it rises up in price and then you're like dude I have some of these This is great for my inventory if I want to get rid of it boom Let's go make a profit like I said I got mine for uh, I got mine for nine So if I want to go sell these for 10 11, you know, there's a couple keys of profit I can go get something else that I want, but I really like wonderments. They're just so bright. The tread is amazing I love these wheels you Gotta try to get me some white ones I should have jumped on them when they were like 35 a couple weeks ago, but that's on me. Oh well. But yeah, green ones. So these ones, um, as I got, what, one more? I got one more Wonderment that I'll show off. But uh, yeah, these things are on the rise, as a lot of the uh, Wonderments are. So if you have them, you know, come to this website again, rl.insider.gg. Come check these prices out. It, this thing is fair. This thing is, like, gorgeous. This website is Mwah, beautiful i love this website very fair and you know <laughs> it, it tracks prices so spectacularly yeah that's a word right it, it's just amazing i love this but yeah so four screen wonderments um if you if you've been sitting on wonderments hoping you know that they'll go up and you got them kind of when they're at their low point a few weeks ago and you're like okay you know these are going to go up because we all knew wonderments we're going to go back up the hype the overhype phase, I think, is pretty much over now. So that means, you know, they're starting to go back up a little bit and a little bit more. And they're going to eventually settle to where they should be. Where will these settle? I can't really say. Because um, once uh, the Christmas crates are gone, or Santa crates, I should say, once they're gone, you know, there's gonna not going to be too many of these wheels left. And everyone's going to probably <laughs> be clamoring to get whatever color they want, whether it's white, crimson, sky blue. I don't know, lime, forest green, purple, you know, whatever it might be, cobalt, whatever. Um, so, yeah, green ones are on the rise right now. Looks like they kind of started to, you know, even out, but we'll check that out, in, you know, within the coming days, see if they kind of even out at 10 to 12. Even so, if you picked them up for cheaper than that, go ahead, sell them right now. 10 to 12 forest green ones, please, <laughs> use this website, it's amazing. Love this website. Um, the other Wonderman I wanted to uh, go over with with you guys is the purple ones. Now, um, purple along with the green, with the white and the red, and probably the sky blue and cobalt are probably the more popular colors in terms of wheels and you know other stuff. But um, again, uh, purple is starting to see kind of like a 
you know, starting to even it out, but it's got a little bit of a jump here as of today, but we'll go over that in a second. So we'll just go back a week here. Um, actually going back a week, we got the same price. Uh, actually 11 to 13. Then they did take that dip for a few days down to 9 to 11. So um, dropping, what, two keys? Yeah, dropping two keys of value kind of sucks. But then, uh, you know, they're only down there for what? Day, day and a half or something like that. And then they started going back up, 11 to 13. And they're starting to evening out again. So if, you, um, if you're on the impression that the Wonder Mints were still dropping, no, pump the brakes. The, the Wonder Mints are going the other way. They're going back up. They're going back up. They're not going down. They're going up. So um, if you want any any of these painted wheels, any painted Wonder Mints, now is the time to get them before they keep going up. So jump on any of these Wonder Mints. I like purple. Never had really a purple car, but I'd love to just have some of these for my collection. These Wonderment, any Wonderment is beautiful. Burnt Sienna's even look, Burnt Sienna looks good. How many times do you say that for a car or for a painted wheel? Never? I don't think so. But uh, no, purple Wonderments, you know, they're starting to even it out at 11 to 13, but they had, they did slightly see a rise today actually for one key. Um, then again, that could just be a very minor spike and it might go back down, but. Um, if you're thinking purple wonderments were under 10 keys for any reason, they're not. They're above it, 11 to 13, possibly on the rise here. So be heads up, you know, about that stuff if you're looking to get these. Um, hey, if they're gonna keep, if they're gonna continue to rise, like I said earlier, you're gonna want to jump on them. Get yourself some of these wonderments, any of these painted ones now, before the hype really starts to set in and people are like, okay. Now's the time to get them because once everybody wants to buy it, people are going to up and up and up and up their price. And then you're going to be left out in the cold because you're like, ah, oh, I seen in that video a couple weeks ago, I should have bought these. And now, you know, they rose five to eight to 10 keys. So jump on these right now. It's, it, it's a great time to do it. I know it's 10 to tw or 12 to 14 isn't really cheap for a lot of us, but if you got, you know, even, um, items that are worth that do it jump on it sell it trade it get yourself some awesome looking wheels right now so we got that done i'm gonna cross these out as i go so the green and the purple are the only wonderments i wanted to talk about um still got a few more wheels on here where's this next one at what are they called dracos there they are the draco orange orange dracos now maybe you've heard people talking about this and maybe you actually know why the, the orange dracos are going up i mean Go back to, you know, middle of January. There's three to four keys. Nobody wanted these. They were kind of just, eh. You know, nobody really thought twice about them. They looked very similar to the default ones. Well, then that story came out where Rocket League was, or, or Psionics, they came out with um, that they're going to start possibly removing some of the, the painted wheels that look like the default in the orange Draco. Oh, let me back up. So when they say they're going to remove the painted wheels that look a lot like the default ones, um, they're gonna if you have them so for example if you have orange Dracos in your inventory and Psyonix goes ahead and ends up deleting all orange Dracos doesn't mean you lose your Dracos it just means once that update does happen if it does um, you will end up getting a different color Draco in your inventory so these orange ones could end up if you have one in your inventory the orange could end up changing to a white to a crimson a sky blue a green a purple a lime you know whatever <laughs> black whatever it might be so um yeah so they're three to four for the longest time and they started seeing a slight rise because people started picking up on this and they're like whoa wait what's going on with these dracos so four to five about a week ago and now they're up to five to seven people are starting to uh, kind of go crazy over these you know they're like there's even a chance that i can own like a very cheap draco wheel and it could end up turning into a white one go for it especially like and the certification from what I've heard it could be subject to change I don't think it will but um, say you have a striker orange Draco and then this update say it does come out in I don't know a week or whenever it might come out um, so you have a striker orange Draco it could it will and it changes to a white one right you will end up keeping the striker certification so you will now have you went from orange striker Dracos to white striker Dracos just like that for having these orange wheels that nobody really looked at twice so yeah orange dracos are definitely more expensive if you didn't already know but don't don't go overpay for these by any means i mean i don't want you to go up and be like i got 10 15 keys dropping them on orange dracos i mean if you're gonna pick up multiple and 10 to 15 keys is fine but not a, not for one 
I've seen some ridiculous offers on uh, Rocket. What is that? Rocket League, uh, the Garage, whatever. Trading what? Web- oh, burp. That trading website and um, Game Flip. Not Game Flip. Um, what's the app? Gamer Link. I've seen some crazy people asking for. I've seen somebody asking for twenty two for just regular orange Dracos. I'm like, dude, they're not that, and they're not worth that much. There's not even a guarantee that this update will remove the orange Dracos. I still think it's a strong possibility, but there, you know, there's a chance that it doesn't happen. But anyway, orange Dracos are probably worth more than you think if you haven't kept up with prices recently or heard any news about the switching of paint colors. So yeah, orange Dracos definitely worth more than you think right now. Coming at five to seven, cross out that one, aren't they? Well, uh, we got a couple more wheels I want to go over with. Um, what do I got here? Aha! This one is um, actually pretty sick. It is a uh, painted uncommon wheel if i'm not mistaken it's uncommon yeah it's uncommon all right um let's go down here scrolling down nope nope here we go black dj now you're gonna be like painted uncommon that can't be worth that much right check this out right here proof on screen black dj eight to ten i'm ruining eight to ten keys for this thing black dj's okay I'm going to tell you, I have one of these in my inventory. I'm keeping this. This thing looks gorgeous. If, you, if you're if uh, you one of those people that really loves the black wheels, you know, um, you just want, like, solid black in the middle. You know, you don't you don't need anything too fancy. DJs are a great way to go. I mean, if you, <laughs> if you got the keys. But, uh, like, DJs, for the longest time, they weren't really, you know, they weren't sought after. I mean, look at this. I go back to November 1st. They're 34 keys. You know, everyone's like, eh, whatever, you know. Painted uncommon, no big deal. Get over to about December. December's when they started jumping up. They got to four to five. Took a little bit of dive and then kind of did a little roller coaster for a little bit and started just rising. They got up to seven to nine, took a little dip, and then they started stabilizing at seven to nine. And now they're on their way. This is crazy. They're on their way at eight to ten currently. It's been there for a day or two now, actually about two days. So if you have black DJs and you didn't know about this, you're sitting on a good solid 8 to 10 keys. I mean, these things are, uh, you know, just speaking from experience from what I've had in my inventory, what I've had on my car, these wheels are absolutely gorgeous. Go get yourself some of these if, if you want. I mean, these things could continue to slowly keep rising because um, these are easily the most sought after uncommon painted wheel in the game they're just they, they just look so good they really do uh i can't lie you know um so yeah black dj's if you have these and you didn't know about it they're they're 10 keys you can get something pretty good in return if you don't even like the way they look put them up on a trade website be like yo i got black dj's offer something you can get something pretty good in return Black DJs are highly sought after right now. These things, uh, they're going up in price. So, uh, yeah. Oh, man. What's up next? What do I got next? Black DJs. Uh, black. Ooh. Ooh. Here's another. A uh, couple more um, trade up. Oh, the trade up wheels. Uncommons. Whatever you want to call them. Uh, it's the Tunica. I like the black Tunica. Um, I've had a couple of these. I don't anymore. I want to get some again. But um, black Tunicas. Um, Again, people don't really pay attention too much to these wheels. They probably just go, eh, you know, they're just whatever. Um, I wish I had something different. Well, these things are still worth keys. I mean, they're three to four. Sure, they're three to four for the longest time. Took a slight dip down to two to three about a few days ago. But they're, they're back up to three to four. So you've got black tunicas, you know, and, you, and you're looking for, a, you know, like a pretty decent uh, trade or like a kind of a small add-in, you know. This is a good way to go. Uh, and if you can get these for cheap from people that don't know the price of these things, you know, you, you trade a couple crates and pick up a black tunica, you're doing you're doing splendid. These trades, you know, these wheels are worth way more than people think because nobody thinks to even look up these prices for these wheels. And I love just collecting these. I say this a lot. Uh, the sunburst wheels, the white ones, they're like my go-to wheel if I want to start kind of building up some keys. Or just some good small items. I'll go buy um, the white sunburst for two, and then I know I can easily sell it for about three. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, 
I think I'm st still dealing with this little bit of a cold, but uh, I think it's starting to pass through, so good good on that, right? <coughs> Dang it. Ooh. Ah, cold suck. But uh, no, any on trade up on common wheels, if you, if you have them, look up their prices. I gave you the website, rl.insider.gg. Look these things up. These have value. The white ones, the black ones, and um, meh, some of the crimson ones and a couple green and purple do. So, yeah, come onto this website if you have them. Check these out. You might be sitting on some keys and you don't even know it. So, I mean, Black Dicha, and I just talked about the Sunburst. Uh, the Black Sunburst are kind of like the same thing here. Um, pretty much uh, two and a half to three and a half keys. Just go over this one real quickly. There's the little graph on screen. But um, these things kind of stabilized for a long, <coughs> a long time. Um, I think they're about two to three, and then they kind of did their little jump up to like three to four. Because um, uh, at the same time, that's when the black uh, DJs were starting to keep starting to keep going up. So people were trying to jump on some of the other black trade up wheels, such as the uh, Sunburst, the Tunica. I think some people thought Vortex, perhaps. What was the other one? I think Spider was the other one, right? spider yeah i think spider was the other one but uh no hey come on here if you got some unpainted wheels or unpainted you got some painted uncommon wheels check their prices out they could be worth something i mean look at this did i ever know that the green forest green sunburst were worth one to two no but they're bright they're bright as hell you can see that right on screen pick up the pick up the wheel you want to go for a forest green car you know just something pretty uh you know small and not that expensive but it still looks good as a car four screen sunburst one to two i didn't even i didn't know that myself i might have to go pick one of these up just just because i, I want it i'm on a big four screen kick for some reason right now i'm trying to get a lot of stuff but um yeah four screen sunburst good way to go so mark that crush that off what else we got <coughs> it's cold it's cold it's gonna go away eventually um let's go to um car bodies what was it um bow, bow. moving on down uh no wait 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 what am i even looking for i'm all over the place right now all right let's just do decals i got some decals on here i want to show off so decals um now we all know white octane is the car to have so if you got like a decal that goes along with it which we all know lone wolf is probably the top decal the white one is the top decal to have um, if you don't want a black market it looks great don't get me wrong but um, some of the other ones that go along pretty well with it are the uh, uh, Thanatos um, some people you know they might overlook it because a lot of collectors would be like I got the white octane now I need a white lone wolf and they would, and they won't think about some other decals that go along with it in this case the white uh, um, <coughs> <coughs> Sorry about all the coffee. Nice. <laughs> it's bugging me more than it bugs you probably. But um, White Thanatos, they were like 3 to 4. I mean, they had a little jump there. But um, then they settled at 3 to 4. Got another nice little spike. Came back down. But now they pretty much even out. They're back up to 4 to 5. So if you got these, if, if you have this sitting in your inventory and you don't even know about it, you know, there's going to be somebody out there with a White Octane that's like, yo, I got to get something good. Maybe I don't want the Lone Wolf and I want something else. White Thanatos right here four to five keys something good to go after um <laughs> a dream for me is to get the white octane and then i want to own all the good white um uh decals for the car so i want the lone wolf i want thanatos i got uh slimline there's uh some other stuff on here that i'm gonna go over but i just want all the good you know, that way i can just you know mix and match you know see what looks b the best in my opinion and that i would love to rock so Maybe I can get that done. We'll see. But uh, no, White Thanatos coming in about four to five. <coughs> oh. Yeah, White Thanatos about four to five. A little more than I thought it was right now. So, yeah, good there. Crush that one out. Um, I did <coughs> mention the Slimline. <coughs> ah, sorry. Slimline, what are we at? Um, yeah, here we go. Uh, just on screen real quick. Uh, white Slimline is about two and a half to three and a half. This thing's been out for uh a little under two months because it came out in the velocity crate um so yeah it's starting to settle down at like the two and a half to three and a half key range plus it just looks good it's just nice and just a couple lines makes the car look slick so white uh white slimline if you want to look out for that only a couple keys it'll cost you 
So, yeah, there you go with the white octane. What else we got? Oh, purple lone wolf. Where's the lone wolf? Lone wolf is on here somewhere. There it is. Go over to lone wolf. I didn't really realize this, but lone wolf has kind of been, uh, um, I don't want to say on the rise, but it's got a little hype behind it. I mean, purple lone wolf, longest time. Is pretty much like a solid one key. I know it says one to two, but it's pretty much a solid one. Then it started to jump up a little bit. Um, two to three for a few days. Drop down to one and a half to two and a half. Starting to drop back down. One and a half, two. This thing could probably reach like an actual solid two keys worth of value. So you could look between, you know, two to three. But no, Purple Lone Wolf I've seen uh, got a little spike in activity recently. So that is something to keep in mind. If you got one in your inventory and you... I don't know, you forgot about it, you post it up again. Somebody will probably want this. Purple is, you know, one of the hot colors that people love to uh, kind of play with on their car, whether it's, you know, decals or wheels or boost or, you know, whatever it might be. So Purple Lone Wolf, you know, slightly slightly more than uh, their one key value right now. So you could probably get two keys out of it. Probably be a safe bet. Um, let's also cross those out. <coughs> Colds. What can you do? Well, let's go up to car bodies. Where am I? Where are these car bodies? They're up here still, aren't they? Yeah, here we go. Here we go. What do we got? Uh, just two cars I want to go over. One is, of course, the Octane. Uh, Octane. Now, it is the gray Octane, actually, to be more specific. You know, the white one was, uh, you know, that's the one to have. But um, the gray one actually looks pretty white for the most part. So if you got... Um, if you got this gray one and you don't realize it, I mean, for a while I was sitting at maybe four to five, and then the white octane started shooting up in price. People are going crazy. So if the white jumps crazy, you know, jumps up to a crazy kind of price, the gray is going to go up with it, you know, slightly. So, you know, uh, two weeks ago we got four to five keys, but now, you know, very solid five to seven, and it's even starting to shoot up just a tiny bit more, up to six to eight. So. Gray Octane is on the rise, and if you, if you really want a white one but you can't afford it, Gray Octane is a great substitute. It still looks really white, um, the trim of the car, you know, where the the, the gray will be. Um, you could still, you could, if you really want, you could just fool people to thinking you got uh, a gray oct or a white octane with the gray one. So yeah, gray octane, six to eight keys. This thing's going up, and it might actually just kind of sit there for a little while, as long as this octane continues to stay hot at around like an eighty to eighty-five, and eh, maybe eighty-five might be a little bit much, but around an eighty key offer, the gray octane is going to be the same thing. Uh, it's going to keep going up with it, ever so slightly. Uh, the last car I want to go over is the. The gray Jaeger. Now, you're thinking the Jaeger. Why the Jaeger? That doesn't see too much play. And, I mean, judging by movement on it, it was one to two keys forever. And then, you know, the whole gray phase is starting to kick in. They're like, dude, gray looks pretty white. You know, and if I can't afford the white version, I'm going to get the gray version. So it went from one to two up to one and a half to two. So pretty much a solid two keys. Uh, dip back down, but it when it when it dips back down ever you know just for like a day day and a half it goes right back up. You know it's about to stabilize up at that new price. So the gray Oc or octane, the gray Jaeger is actually going to probably be a solid two keys. So if if you had one in your inventory that you, I don't know you got as a throw in for you know really cheap or something like that, or you pulled it out of a crate and you're like ah that ain't worth nothing. Well, hold off a little bit because these things are probably going to be worth two keys and they might sit there for a little while. So, uh, Grey Jaeger, something to kind of keep your eyes out for if you want something nice and little and you like the uh, the Grey, you know, if you like the uh, Jaeger itself. So, there's something else. Um, what else are we going over? Got some, um, ooh, boost. We got some boost. All right, let's go up here a little bit. All right, so... First one I want to go over with is the Black Standard, or Standard, there it is, Black Standard 3 to 4. Um, click on that, bring up the graph, there we go, so Black Standard was kind of like 2 to 3 for, you know, a long time. Uh, wasn't one of the more highly sought after boost, but, um, uh, you know, it's it, it's slowly starting to climb, I went to 2.5 to 3.5, back down, but then it took that, um, that rise again and here it evens out three to four it's been three to four for a little i don't know what is that 10 days now so when it when it's evening 
<coughs> oh, I apologize. I'm so sorry about that. Uh, tired of this cold. Whatever. We'll get over it eventually. But three to four for the black standard. So maybe you're thinking, you know, it's two keys or something. Nah, three to four. You got a nice little something here. Put it up. People are looking for it right now. I know that for a fact. I've seen a lot of, um, maybe not a lot, but I've seen at least a handful of people that are like, hey, you got the black standard? I'm like, I wish I did. And then I looked up the price. And I'm like, this thing's jumping. So black standards kind of starting to rise a little bit. Um, I think we got another black boost. What is it? The black flamethrower, right? Now, flamethrower has always kind of been like a, a favorite that I've seen. Um, it's been kind of, you know, kind of lower, kind of like the standard, um, two to three, and then, uh, kind of just had like a little, like a kitty roller coaster. And then recently, um, about, uh, 10, 11 days ago, jumped up to three to four. There's that small dip for about, you know, a day, day and a half, but it jumps right back up to three to four and it's stable there as well. So black flamethrower is also three to four, something to keep an eye out on. You know, it looks pretty good. I like it. I've had that before. I think I've actually had that on my uh, my first 20 to something. I had that as a boost. I thought it was pretty sick. It looked pretty good. I played around with it for a little while. I enjoyed it. Looks good. A um, couple more boosts, and then that's going to wrap it up. What is it? Uh, the White Tachyon. White Tachyon. Um, this thing, um, of course, White Boost, probably, you know, with, you know, <laughs> wheels or decals, are going to be some of the more sought-after ones. This thing was three to four. But then it started just kind of doing like that. I don't know what my price is really going to be. You know, so it's going up and down for a little bit. Two to three and then three to four. Two and a half down to two to three. Now it's back to three to four. So you've got a white tacky on, you know, something people like. Um, it's a good it's a good throw in to uh, a trade if you need it. Just a little something extra. Be like, hey, white tacky on boost. People look for it. So you know you can trade it away or you know you can sell it. So if you're one of those people that are like, I can't sell this immediately. No, here's White Tachyon. It's a nice little throw, and you can definitely get rid of that quickly. So White Tachyon, about three to four. And the last thing I am going to go over is a Neo Thermal Sky Blue. <laughs> Slightly on the rise. <coughs> I mean, look, it's just gradually going, and it's not like it goes up and then down. No, forever. This thing was, you know, one, maybe two keys. But now, ever so slightly, back on, what, January 23rd, so uh, roughly five, six days ago, one and a half to two keys. This thing started seeing slight increase in uh, people that wanted it, went up to one and a half to two and a half, fell down slightly, but now it's back up. It's up to two to three keys right now, so Sky Blue Neothermal. Um, like myself, there's a lot of people that like the Sky Blue stuff out there, so if you want a Sky Blue Neothermal, you know, uh, it's a good way to go. Um, two to three, it, it, it's a great boost. It looks great. It really does. Um, but, uh, yeah, this thing's on the rise. And uh, if you didn't know about it, now you do. So Sky Blue Neothermal going up along with some of the other stuff I listed. You know, just some more, just some things that I wanted to get out to, to you guys to let you know that, hey, these things are worth more than they might be. So there you go. Um, but anyway, I think that's pretty much going to wrap it up. We don't know, we went over, what, about 15-ish eh, items or so? That's not too bad. So with that being said, uh, I'd like to thank you all for stopping by as usual. I do truly appreciate it. Thank you, guys. But, um, yep, that is all I got for this week. So uh, thank you all for stopping by, and uh, we'll catch you guys on tomorrow's upload. Peace out, everybody. Tell me pretty lies Look me in the face Tell me that you love me Even if it's fake